At Neuros, just by virtue of the fact that we have an open device, we encounter so many interesting modifications and enhancements to that device. So I decided to create a little series of videos where we talk about the technology, social phenomena, and the trends and the hacks that are shaping TV today and in the future. Some of the trends are the obvious ones that we know will come. The future will hold more choice, better time shifting, and access to content on more portable devices. But the future of TV will be much more, and much more interesting than just that. Connecting the open internet to the TV will give us a lot more than a better, faster, cheaper experience. It will connect us in new and previously unimaginable ways. I want to talk about one of those ways now. It's called crowd narration. And it's the product of a hack done on a Neuros OSD at a BBC-sponsored event by a creative UK developer, Matthew Weil. What crowd narration does is to overlay two lines of chat text over the bottom of the TV image. The chat is in real time, synchronized with the video. And in this example, we have a chat room discussion superimposed over the State of the Union address. In production, you can imagine that there would be multiple chat channels to choose from. Some professionally narrated, some by your friends, some that are open, some closed. Altogether, there might be dozens or hundreds of chat channels for any given event or show. Let's take a look at what one of those might look like for the State of the Union. First, we log on to the chat box service. And unfortunately, my video camera doesn't do a great job with the TV set, but it's good enough to give you an idea of what we're looking at. Some in Washington argue that letting tax relief expire is not a tax increase. And try explaining that to 116 million American taxpayers who would see their taxes rise by an average of $1,800. Others have said they would personally be happy to pay higher taxes. I welcome their enthusiasm. Pleased to report that the IRS accepts both checks and money orders. <laughs> Americans think their taxes are high enough. With all the other pressures on their finances, American families should not have to worry about the federal government taking a bigger bite out of their paychecks. There's only one way to eliminate this uncertainty. Make the tax relief permanent. We live in a world where every minute technology is increasing our empowerment increasing our ability to participate in every discussion, sales pitch, and political debate going on around the globe. It won't all be pretty, or honest, or kind. But if history is any indication, we can expect that free communication will do a better job of bringing the truth out than any central gatekeeper ever could. And now it's your turn. Provide the insight, the humor, the facts, that help the world understand what really is going on. Join us at narration.neurostechnology.com In the future, our voices as fans, consumers, and citizens will be heard.